Howdy, welcome to the Cartoon Quick Draw. I'm Mr. Dan, and today we're drawing a Jack O'Lantern. Starting at about the middle of the page, I just want to draw a small bump. Then connected to my little bump, I'm going to make another bump, but then bring it all the way around and back to the other side of my first bump. Now the cool thing about a pumpkin is you can make it any shape you want. If you want to make it thin and long you can do that. Make it like a circle or make it even fatter. It's all up to you. Pumpkins come in all sorts of sizes. On top of my bumps, I'm just going to draw a curved line diagonally out. Then I'm going to draw a diagonal line going down. Then I'm going to draw another curved line coming to the other side of the bump. Now for the fun part. Let's give our jack-o'-lantern a face. We're going to start with two big triangles up at the top end of our pumpkin. And feel free to color those in. Or if you don't want to make them black, when you go to color, feel free to color them a yellow glow or however you feel. Once you get your triangles colored in, right in between them and a little lower, I'm going to draw a smaller triangle colored in. <clears throat> and then I'm going to give them a nice big smile. I'm going to start here below our first triangle on the left. I'm going to draw a line that goes past the nose and then I'm going to put a small square shape in our line and continue it to the end of the second eye triangle. Then I'm going to make the bottom part by starting again over here on the left, but I'm going to curve down till about the end of the first triangle, and I'm going to make a square shape going up in that line. Once I got that, I'm just going to close off the mouth by drawing a curved line up to the end of our first line. And I'm going to color that in black as well. And if you'd like, you can feel free to stop right there. I'm going to add just a few small lines inside the pumpkin because uh, pumpkins are kind of uh, ripply and uh, they have this texture. So I'm going to start here with our bump and not connected to it. I'm just going to draw a small line going down and curved around the pumpkin. Then I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. I'm just going to add little dashes almost around the pumpkin. Then I'll probably add a few lines on the outside as well. And that's how you draw a Jack O'Lantern.